Hello YouTube, this is <clears throat> DTF48 coming to you with an IP recap right here and then local card shop recap. Um and that's my uh, I got my new background. Well most likely be this. This might interchange sometimes. But these ones are gonna stay there. Um but I went to my the card shop in Fort Wayne. And I got, I pulled, I got a couple box, I got a couple packs of, uh, the 2012 Prestige. And here's just some of the base I got. Dirk, Hito, uh, OJ Mayo, Jeremy Lin, Kevin Garnett, Renee, Jason Thompson, Blake Griffin, uh, I got two Avery Bradleys, uh, Nicholas Batum, and a Glenn Davis. I um, wasn't, I mean, it was okay, I guess, but, I mean, um, I got two nice inserts. I think they're inserts, I'm pretty sure. And then I got a pack of threads, and I had gotten Rondo, Gasaw, Dirk, Booker, uh, Terrence Williams, uh, Marcin Gortat, Darrell Wright, Josh Smith, and Karan Butler. And then, uh, like for the better cards in the pack, the two rookies in the Prestige. I got one in each pack. Um, the worst of the two, Donald Sloan. And then I got Clay Thompson. And then Fred's pack, uh, this was different. The, uh, the uh, OJ Mayo red at the bottom, not nothing else to it. It's just plain. When well, everything else is like bronze, so I guess that's just like the better card. And then in the prestige, I got the uh, stars of the NBA, Carlos Boozer. I think this is a nice looking card. I think. Um, nothing else. It's number 23. And then uh, the better card was this all-star, Chris Paul. That was probably the best of the uh, packs. And then I got, I bought a couple extra things. I bought a lot of base Cubs, like Cubs base, like of older people or some current people, like um. I'm, gonna, I'm trying to go to the, I think we're going to try to go to the Cubs convention, but I also found this. I haven't seen this card yet, but it's a, uh, if you're trying to do this set, it's a um, Blake Griffin, card number two. It's kind of different too, it says starting five, and down here, if you look at, like the other Blake Griffin I have, um, Like this one, it's his uh, away jersey, and this one's his home one. And the regular one's 61, and this one's number two. So I don't know if this is different or not, or if this is like a promo card, or I don't know. Just starting five, and then down here in the bottom, it, instead of saying, like, this one says I collect Panini. And then this one doesn't have anything. I think it's got more words too. But yeah, um, just thought that was different. So I've got this. This is only 50 cents. So I don't know if anybody knows about that. Let me know. Because I don't know anything about that kind of. But yeah, it's a different too because he's dunking. But then uh, for the hits, this was $2. I got a uh, patch of Craig Brackens, um, about three, two breaks, three breaks, uh, there's blue right here, so there's the, the yellow part of the jersey, that's nice, and then the two autos I got were, uh, Kevin Seraphim, this is only a dollar, so I'll pick that up, I like these classic, or not contender, yeah, contenders patches. 
and then uh, Robin Lopez. And the um, jersey of Quincy or Craig Brackens is 251 out of 399, and then this Robin Lopez is 56 out of 99. And then uh, for the and I also got these magnetics. I bought three magnetics, and then I had this one, but uh, I'll just show these because I don't think I've ever showed them. Uh, Michael Orr Letterman from the Blind Side, numbered one of eleven. And then I got these magnetics while I was there. Uh, magnetic for Rajon Rondo, this two color patch. And then gold standard, number 16 out of 25. Um, this gold standard, 1011 gold standard, Kevin Love, gold bars. And this one is prime materials, autograph. This is prime right there. Uh, oh, this is a prime materials four color jersey card. Yeah, blue, black. A silver strip and then more like part of white jersey, I guess. And that's number 10 of 25. And then I got this. This is probably the better of the regular cards. Uh, John Havlicek 910 Classics or 910 Contenders, Playoff Contenders. Um, number 23 out of 25. I looked up the book value and it's like the book value of that card is like between 30 and 50 and I only paid like 10 bucks for it so but yeah that's I've got a Mark Sanchez which is like valued at 90 a rookie card out of 200 but I don't think it's that much anymore because he kind of blew up his career I think but um and then I went to the Fort Wayne Maddox game with my cousins and I got three cards, three of three from Luke Henry. There's one. This one was the nicest looking one. And then this one started getting downhill. Then I got a uh, jersey card sign, which he started like over here. And if you can see that, he hit the jersey card. And then he just like scribbled the rest. Like, you compare it from this and this. I mean, it's a jersey card, and I, I know it's a sign in person, and it's 390 out of 399. But I also have a uh, Letterman signed one. But so, yeah, you can tell this one. This one was the closest to this. And then this, uh, these two are far from. So, yeah. And by the way, those are the Waterman patches. Pittman, Whiteside, two Heron goaties, and a um, alibi. So I'm an alibi. And then the um, Mojo, I guess. I got one Prism card signed by Orlando Johnson. He's like one per. He got hurt too. Um, I got one before on the Prestige. This is pretty nice. And then uh, I got two 8x10 signs because he's going to be probably pretty good. This one was pretty good. But then uh, this one, it looks really good in person. Well, no, the camera is kind of helping this out. You can see that. I mean, it looks a lot better, I think. It kind of looks good on, it looks, I think it looks a little bit better on camera. I don't know, it's just the way the light picks up. This one, I he messed up on the H the J, or the J a little bit, but yeah, that's pretty nice. Um, Miles Plumley was there too, and uh, he like saw us, and he went out the back way. So um, the wife of a t player on the team, um, Ron Howard, he uh, played, he got called up to the Pistons I think a year ago or last year. Um. She's gonna have him get my Plumley stuff, and I gave her my four Orlando Johnson cards too. And uh, she's gonna try to get those signed and mail them to me. Hope she does, but yeah. So then I'll have five prisms. So um, let me know what you think. Um, 
It's only six autographs. Uh, I'm not going to complain, though, because three are of an NBA player. So, uh, thanks. Peace. Sorry for the long video.